Hey everyone, welcome back to this week's video. So in today's video I'm talking about bee oil from The Ordinary. This was one of the newest products they launched, I think it was last year now. And I went down to the counter months back and they kindly gave me one, they gave me loads of goodies and this was one of them. And I used it a few for a few times and then just suddenly stopped using it. But I've been using it this week as well and I just don't know if I like it or not, I've got to be completely honest. I do like it but I don't think it'd be suitable for everyone. But what I'm going to do, I'm going to try it on my skin, show you it all and then we're going to go through a little bit of the Desian website just showing you basically what the pro telling you what the product does and how it works, all that good stuff. So let's just get onto the website now. Right, okay, it's £8.70 which is super affordable. It's water based, sorry, it's water free, alcohol free, oil free. Oh, right, okay, so it is oil free. I didn't know if it was or not. And it is suitable for all skin types, silicone free as well. I do like it, but I just don't know if throughout the day it makes me go a little bit greasy or if it will. Like, I can't decide if it. I like it once I put it on my skin, but then I'm like, throughout the day, will I look greasy? But without sounding. <laughs> Weird. I sort of like the greasy look, not the greasy look, but like, you know, the oily, dewy look, which I'm sure everyone knows. But I do like it, but I think like in the summer, I don't think it'll work well with me. Even though I'm not an oily skin type either, it's just because it's an oil, it's like a cold pressed oil. This is what I imagine it to be like, but I'm going to show you all how I apply it. It says it's a purified micro allergy blend of squalene oils, argan, babella, Brazil nuts. Some of them I can't even need. Rose hip to help support skin defence or enhance radiance. Yeah, so it does. Makes your help radiant. And then it says the formula imparts golden green who a mild herbal odour as a result. Yeah, there is definitely a smell. Do you know what it reminds me of? It reminds me of Sunday Riley's Juno. It's like that quite earthy smell, which is like trees. And at first when I tried Sunday Riley, I was like, ugh, I don't like it. But then it grew on me and I think this is going to be the exact same because it honestly reminds me of Juno. But a fraction of the price, Juno is about £50 for the, the big size and this is eight. Let's just begin. So it's suitable for all skin types. Directions. Apply a few drops daily as of needed or to the entire face. Ideally after water-based treatments, obviously because you've got to bear in mind how you're, which order you apply your products. Use only as directed. Patch test and prior before use. Oh, that's fine. What did he use it? Reviews. Okay, so it's got 97 reviews. So someone said, I tried bio for two and a half months and the experience was the worst breakout of my entire life. This is the only thing because I find it is a little bit thick. I do think after a while it could break it out. This is where I'm on the fence a bit with it. I'm on the fence of wanting to look radiant and glowing, but then also on the fence of not wanting a breakout. Someone can't tolerate the smell. Someone's put. I felt like I peeled off all my serums I put on beforehand. Well, it will. You've got to put this on last. You're going to put, because it's a thicker oil, you're going to put it on last. So, always bear in mind, it's so important to get your order of your skincare products right. Because there's no point in putting a thick cream on and then something light on top of it. It just, it, you've got to think if your skin has got layers. So, you want to get your thinnest products first and then your thicker products on the top. This will be a thicker product. So, there's no point in putting this on the top of your skin and then putting on lighter products on top because it... It, it just won't absorb so imagine your skin is layers so if you put this on and then a lighter one it's just gonna sit on the top of your skin which will peel pill even and then that's one it'll start to lift your other products you've applied underneath so just always bear that in mind you've got to layer your products and you've also got to give your, your products time to absorb as i say your skin's got layers if you just throw them all on which i have done within an hour's time it's just a hot mess so always bear that in mind Hey, let's just let's just jump into it. Um, as I say, I am a bit on the fence. I love how it gives me skin a glow. I went into work the other day, wore it for the first time, and everyone was like, your skin looks gorgeous. And I was like, oh, I'm trying a new product. The only thing is, I just think later on throughout the day or over a few months, I don't know if I could clog, clog pores, potentially. But so far, I like it. I haven't got any issues with it. Okay, so it's green. It's crazy. So this, it's so much like Juno from Sunday Riley. It's a little bit thinner probably than Juno. Yeah, and it smells like the earth. It just reminds me of Juno. Okay, so what I'm going to do, that's a bit much. I'm just going to take a few drops in my hands and watch the glow. And then all I'm going to do, let me a minute, is just press and pass it into my skin. I 
my parents were laughing for the day as I said I went into work the other day with it and a few people commented and said oh what have you got on your skin and I was like I'm trying something new that's that's nothing new though they're always like that to me what are you trying now you can only leave a few small drops you could put SPF over this it'd be fine you've just got to really wait till it's till it's absorbed so this is why i'm just thinking imagine in the summer obviously you get hot anyway i just don't know if it would be a great match you see what i mean about the glow i could just it just screams like healthy, gorgeous, luminous, fabulous skin. But you've just got to bear in mind, because it is a little bit more thicker, it could potentially clog your pores. But as so far, I've had no issues with it. I have had a little breakout here, but that's that's not from that. Oh, what the glow. Imagine this. Might be a little bit too heavy, actually. You could mix a tiny bit in with like a foundation, just slightly, just to give it a bit more of a glow. But I think it might be a little bit but you never know you could try but do you know what this is the part i love but then i just I, i'm on the fence this is where i'm saying i think down the line i think it could break me out just because of the thickness and then i'm thinking we are going into summer although we're, we're still in winter but we'll see i am going to still keep using it. as i say i used it liked it and then just stopped using it so i need to really start using it again but i've been using it the past week in work because i knew i wanted to film with it but yeah, so far so good. I've got no complaints as of as of yet. I love how it leaves my skin. I've had compliments on it as well. So I do actually like it for the price, £8.70. It's a no-brainer. But obviously just bear in mind, because it is a bit more thicker, and again, make sure you're layering your products well, just because if you don't, it, it won't work. So, but yeah, so far as of now, I do like it. I love, I just love the glow it gives to my skin. But yeah, so I hope you've all enjoyed this video. Let me know if you've tried it. Let me know if anyone's tried it, got it months back and have been using it for consecutive months now and you've actually seen a difference or it's broke your house or whatever it may be. Let me know because I'd like to hear everyone else's thoughts as well on it. Just let me know what they think. So yeah, any info, just leave it in the comment section below. But I hope you've all enjoyed the video. I actually do really like it, I've got to say. But I hope you all have a fabulous day and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.